It's time for the weekly news with Adam Yetzer. The Oscars aired on Sunday and were the second lowest rated in history until two hours, 45 minutes and 18 seconds in, at which point they became the highest rated in history. A survey found that two out of three people think Will Smith should be charged with a crime. The survey was taken in 1999 after they watched Wild Wild West. (laughs) I went on that set. Coda became the first streaming movie to win Best Picture proving that a film can win an Oscar on any platform so long as nobody watched it. (laughs) A plus-sized model called out Delta on TikTok because their seatbelts don't fit around her waist and because the jet bridge collapsed. (laughs) Oh, no. (laughs) Epstein Island is now for sale. It features a beautiful estate, a guest house, and plenty of room for kids to run around. Oh, Some sad news, rock drummer Taylor Hawkins died this week at the age of 50 after a long fight with Fu. Oh, no. (laughs) Researchers at Harvard and MIT have found that despite previous claims, alcohol provides no health benefits. Students conducted the research in their physiology class, after their physiology class, the night before their physiology class, and on weekends. (laughs) Saudi Arabia has finally announced plans for the country's first ski resort after making women wear ski masks for 1,300 years. Oh, man. (laughs) The Tin Man's oil can from The Wizard of Oz sold at auction for $250,000, coincidentally to someone who doesn't have a brain. (laughs) The price works out to $50,000 for the can and $200,000 for the three drops of oil left inside. Oh, man. Phil Collins and Genesis performed their final concert at the O2 Arena in London this week, four years after their final fan died. (laughs) U.S. troops in Poland are training Ukrainian soldiers how to use weapons provided by the West and explaining to the Polacks why their submarines shouldn't have screen doors. Oh, man. I love a good Pollock show. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been, it's a, been while. a while. North Carolina Republican Madison Cawthorn claims DC elites invited him to an orgy. In fairness, they heard the name Madison Cawthorn and, and assumed he was a female porn star. <laughs> <laughs> the Supreme Court is going to consider whether Andy Warhol committed copyright infringement with his silkscreen images of Prince. It's the case of two dead guys versus none of this matters anymore. <laughs> The world's first space hotel is scheduled to open in 2027, sucking everyone inside out into space. (laughs) Open. I get it. The NFL has announced it is creating a new diversity committee. I don't know why. The NFL is already the only industry that has just one elderly white man. (laughs) Pete Davidson got a new tattoo that says, my girl is a lawyer, even though Kim Kardashian is not technically a lawyer. And is also not technically his girl since that Turnip. belongs to the streets. <laughs> oh, man. Can we say, oh, oh my goodness. We can't put another word over it. <laughs> you guys will find some other word to put over it. All right, I did a Tom Brady joke and a Pete Davidson joke, so I should be almost done. <laughs> a study found that one in four Americans have eaten out of the trash or while sitting on the toilet. Now I admit I have never eaten on the toilet, but I have eaten out of the trash before. But what I do is I pull my mask down to eat out of the trash, then put it back up again so I don't catch COVID. <laughs> That's it for the weekly news. If you want to see more, check out the canceled news on my YouTube channel. Hi, Justin Trudeau here. I am so sorry you had to see that. Their videos are problematic, eh? Whatever you do, don't like, subscribe, or comment. It just encourages them, eh? Uh, These guys joke about things you shouldn't be joking about. And quite frankly, and pardon my French Canadian, they're real jerks.